Hey guys, so in this little vlogging style video, I'm just gonna go through my updated breakfast. Uh, it has changed a little bit uh, since the last couple of years when I did the last one, so let's jump straight into it. This is a really delicious breakfast, by the way, it tastes very good. And I have two different kinds of this. So this one has purple rice and the other one I changed from time to time has sweet potatoes as a carbohydrate source, okay? Um, and the eggs are whole eggs and it's five whole eggs, okay? And then we got a little bit of peanut butter here. Peanut butter is homemade, um, more healthy and has added omega-3 flaxseed oil to it, which is 80% omega-3. So it's a healthy kind of peanut butter. Um, the reason you want to eat whole eggs is like super important. Um, actually, the yolk, the yellow stuff, you know, has so many micronutrients that the body can use to recover and to basically rebuild itself after hard trainings. And if you don't believe that, well, then I have a little, um, <laughs> I have a little uh, question for you. Um, imagine this is inside an egg, right? comes from an egg. Inside the egg is possible to build a full chicken, a small chicken, um, right? So it means inside this egg yolk uh, and uh, of course the egg white is everything you need to build a um, living creature. And that could as well be a human. That means it has all the ingredients in it to build uh, basically um, a body. Uh, regardless of if it's a chicken or a human, it's pretty much built of the same stuff, you know. So uh, it can build muscle, bone, um, skin, whatever you name it, the whole whole deal, right? <laughs> Maybe a few feathers <laughs> if you're lucky. <laughs> Anyways, um, the reason you want to eat purple rice instead of um, white rice is it has a lower glycemic index it means your blood sugar will be more stable has a glycemic index at around 50 instead of 80 compared to white rice and it has since it's not purified or treated with all kinds of um, procedures and processing uh, methods it has more micronutrients as well uh, compared to white rice okay same thing goes for sweet potato uh, has also a low glycemic index compared to normal white potatoes or yellow potatoes or, or whatever you want to call it. And regarding the amount of food, uh, so five whole eggs and depending on how hard you train and what your training goals and body weight goals are, uh, you will adjust the amount of rice accordingly and maybe the peanut butter. So let's say if you wanted to lose your weight you would cut away some of the rice and also the peanut butter, okay? Because that's high calories. You don't want to cut away any eggs because it's super important to have uh, a cer certain amount of protein in your diet. Otherwise, you won't be able to maintain your muscle. If you can't maintain your muscle, you cannot train as hard and you cannot even burn as many calories, okay? So this was an updated video on the eggs. And uh, the breakfast that I eat every morning and I never get tired of eating it. So I think you will like it too. Give it a try. It also has salt and pepper. And by the way, the amount of salt uh, you add should also be matching the amount of sweat you sweat when you're training. So if you've had a super hard training the day before, you want to add a bit more salt. And you may even notice that you actually enjoy the taste of salt more uh, when you have trained really hard. That's pretty interesting because your body knows what it needs. So, um, and then we'll also have a look at my veggie smoothie soon. <laughs> 